Audi has a specific reputation for making cars not so pleasant to drive for enthusiasts. Either it is a civil model or an RS. They do not deliver such a joy. However, what they really know is to engineer an engine. Not just one or two, but a whole range of successful and popular engines, which receive their respect from a community for a reason. Turbo. The 2.2 liter engine must be the most legendary engine by Audi as it appeared in the Audi Sport Quattro S1 but also the first family wagon of the brand as well, the RS2. The displacement was shared across many models with and without a turbo like S2, S4, S6, 80 or 100. The most powerful iteration was in the RS2 co-developed by Porsche. V8. If BMW is renowned for inline sixes, Audi besides the 5 cylinders is known for the 4.2 liter V8. Not all, but people already know it. The very first one came out with the Audi V8, which was basically the first gen Audi A8. Later models with this label featured 5 valves per cylinder heads and also a twin turbo came along. One of the best version is the higher wing one in the B8 RS4 redlining at 8500 rpm. TDI. Something that Audi is really good at is making compression ignition engines. Their diesels prove that high fuel mileage and high power can go hand in hand. It started around 2004 with a single Borg Warner variable geometry turbo making 204 horsepower. That raised to impressive but still very modest output of 320 horsepower in case of the A7 and SQ5 TDI. That one pulls everywhere between 1000 and 5000 rpm like crazy. FSI. There are only a few companies which bother to bless this world by a V10 and Audi was one of them. Before the 5.2 unit was introduced, it was an even firing 5 liter used in the Lamborghini Gallardo, but then they modified it for the new baby Lambo, a new Audi R8 and also luxury limousines like S6 and S8. <laughs> TFSI. Following the legend, it is nice to see Audi bringing back the 5 banger back in 2009 in the Audi TT RS. It has the very same displacement as the naturally aspirated Volkswagen's 2.5 liter, but this one has a turbo on it making up to 400 horsepower in a family hatchback, the RS3. There is nothing like a beautiful sounding 5 pot.
2.7 V6 by turbo. The twin turbocharged 2.7 liter is quite a tuning friendly engine, obviously because of ease to turn up the boost. Anyhow, it likes to make power and once Cosworth sort of touched the engine, you know it means business. Although it was only in the RS4 engine Cosworth worked on, it deserves to be here. <laughs> V10 TFSI. The current 4 litre TFSI was introduced to succeed the turbocharged V10, and to this day, it pretty much overshadowed it. There are plenty of boosted V8s, but if you know a different petrol stock twin turbo V10, there's a comment section to complain in. This 10 cylinder was much stronger than the then sold BMW's V10 and installed in the RS6 Avant body. It pretty much offered the ultimate family vehicle. Mm -hmm. 